Hi everyone, this book is called Little Fox Lost and it's written by Nicole Snitzler. Little Fox Lost. It had snowed all morning and now the sun was showing its face at last. Everything was sparkling and white. Shall we go walking? asked Mama Fox. Oh yes, cried Little Fox. We love to play in the snow. Stay close, Mama Fox reminded him. You don't want to get lost. Down the path, Mama Fox met Mrs. Grey Fox. Isn't it a lovely day? The two of them began to chat. It didn't take long for Little Fox to get bored. He decided to find some fun on his own. If I take ten steps ahead three behind, six to the right, and two to the left. Where will I end up? He wondered. Little Fox looked over his shoulder. His paw prints had made pictures in the snow. If I go round this tree, under that branch, and over the little bridge, if I run very fast, what will my tracks look like then? As he spoke, little fox skipped away and he didn't realize he was running deeper and deeper into the forest. Suddenly little fox stopped short. He couldn't see mama fox anywhere. Where am I? How did I get here? He looked around. His paw prints ran in every direction. How could he ever retrace his steps? Mom I'm lost! Little fox was afraid. He began to cry. Don't be frightened, rumbled a deep voice. Startled little fox looked up to see an old owl sitting on a branch. I'm not allowed to talk to people I don't know, little fox hiccuped between two sobs. Don't be frightened, old owl said again. I can fly high in the air. And I can see far ahead. I'll take you back to your mother. Follow me. Old Owl set off, sweeping between the trees. Little Fox raced after him. Then he stopped. No, I, I can't. You can't what? asked Old Owl. I can't follow you, said Little Fox. I've just remembered what Mama always says. If you ever get, if you are, if ever, you are lost, my child. Don't let a stranger guide you. Be still, and I will search the wild until I am beside you. Well, old owl grumbled, if that's what your mama says, then I guess you'd better listen to her. You are lost, so sit still and wait right there. And that's just what little fox did. Several long minutes passed. Then Little Fox said, I have a good idea. If we sing Mama's rhyme together, she might hear us. And so Little Fox and Old Owl began to sing. Little by little, other forest animals drew closer. They began to join the song. If ever you're lost, my child, don't let a stranger guide you. Be still and I will search the wild until I am beside you. Soon, Mama Fox came running through the trees, all out of breath. Little Fox, I've been searching everywhere. Oh, Mama, I was so afraid, Little Fox sniffed. It's all my fault. I'm sorry I wandered off. Mama Fox led the way home. She was proud of her little fox. He had done exactly what he should. That night, Safe in his den, Little Fox fell asleep with the words of Mama's song playing in his head. If you ever, if ever you are lost, my child, don't let a stranger guide you. Be still and I will search the wild until I am beside you. And that's the end of the story. Hope you enjoyed that. Bye.